got a little care package here. Oh, check that out. Sink deeper. Oh, wow. They hooked it up. Oh, wow. These look good. These look real good. You see that? They got a little hole right there for their uh, jig heads to go into. Oh, I'm going to try one of these today. Wow. The pink. Oh, these are going to tear them up. I've been seeing these guys everywhere online recently. Oh, perfect. One and a half. Oh, and they got little ones. Yo. That is awesome. I'm beyond stoked. Shout out Jig Pro Fishing. I think they were, I think their main thing is like actual metal jigs. And they just came out with this recently. And it looks awesome. People were drawing comparisons to other swim baits and other companies out there. But holding them in hand, they're pretty different. They're actually very different from anything I have. Oh man, half ounce on the little guy is going to be so perfect. I'm going to throw that today. And we got some little pink ones. Some one ounces. This is like the most perfect care package. Some quarter ounce. This is the most perfect care package ever. Thank you so much, Jig Pro. We're going to try these today and see what happens. I got a feeling they are going to catch. They look so good. Got some stickers in there. Man, oh man. These look awesome. I cannot wait to try them. They got some good colors too. All the basics, everything you'd want. That one's like brownish. Little white. The little guys so this is cool look they have four inch and three inch that's pretty awesome because i think four inch would be perfect for like verrazano but then you get back in the back creeks you might want to even bump down to three inch and you get out somewhere like the inlet or 50 bridge bump up to the five inch so perfect i'm curious to see they're supposed to be obviously those are great hooks bkk but they're supposed to be really easy to rig on the hook because they have that pre-slotted hole. I don't know if you can really see it. We can probably just open one up here. Oh no, I gotta undo it. But I think you guys can see that little hole and it slides perfectly on. And apparently inside there it like suction cups to this thing to keep your plastic on. I am stoked. Thank you, Jig Pro. Swim jig. JigProFishing.com. Check them out. Let's go catch some fish with these things. Busted out one of the three inch here. And as you can see, that's a cool little paddle tail. It's got like a triangular shape to it. And you see that little hole there now, good. And I'm going to try and rig this bad boy up real quick. And see how easy it is, but... Yeah, that's going to look good. Looks pretty easy to me. Let's give it a shot here. Oh, look, they even pre-mark where the hook comes out. Does it get any easier than that? Wow. Let's try it out. Is there a cavity the whole way? Yep. That's pretty, pretty easy there. Look at that slides right on and you know you got it perfect every time get it over that hook keeper there oh my goodness that is one juicy little swim bait if that doesn't catch me a striper or a trout today i don't know what will man those look good i dig it i dig it let's go see if we can catch some fish with them 
Oh man, this thing looks good. I knew it would, but wow. It's actually got a pretty big profile in the water for a three inch. That thing looks great. I wouldn't be surprised if something munched it right now. All right, we confirmed it. We definitely missed the tide, misjudged it, or just came a little too late, because I'm at, I just can't believe this. I mean, yesterday, Jeff and I went on the drive on, and it was like 2.30, and we felt like we missed it. So today, I came at 12.30, and I was like, oh, no way. I mean, I should be here early, and somehow still missed it. I don't know. Or it's like the tide happened earlier today than it did yesterday. I mean, it's barely out going here. And I don't know, it's crazy. But we ran into a guy at the boat ramp that said he caught a blue and a striper, so they're around. I just can't believe this tide. I don't know how long I'm gonna stay if it stays like this. I mean, the water's still super high. The tide's just not moving. Which, we've caught them here at Slack plenty of times, but it's always, tends to be better when the water's moving. Try some jigging here. I might even try a hard plastic. That's what he said he had to use, which is interesting. I rarely catch anything here on a hard plastic, but. I wanna get one on this new Jig Pro. It looks and feels and swims so good. Just want a fish to eat it. Dude, I'm gonna get broken off here. What is this? Something's dogging the heck out of me. Oh, decent blue or stripe? I can't even see. Whatever it is, it's giving me a good fight. I don't even have a net. Peel and drag, baby. I have to tighten her a little bit. Oh man, dude, this thing is digging like it's a black drum or something. I think it's just a blue fish. Oh yeah, decent blue. You want to net it for me? Taking me on a sleigh ride. Oh dude, it's a... Taking me on a sleigh ride. Oh dude, it's a... Giant weaky! Oh my god, dude, get a net, please. Please, please, quick. Get a net. It's a giant weaky. You spoke it into existence, bro. No, I'm bringing him up right here. Hold on. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh, dude. Please get it this time. I'm bringing him right back. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You're scaring him. Hold on. I'm gonna steer him head first in. Get ready with the net. Oh, he keeps turning away from it. Dude, I've never seen one that big. Get him in there. Get him in there. Yes, dude. Holy shit. It pays off, dude. Dude, I've never seen a wiki that big. Like you gotta get a picture for me real quick. Holy it's shit. Like Holy shit. Should I keep it? Yeah. Or like, I don't really wanna eat it, so I'd rather you just yeah. get a picture on my phone and then release it for me. Hold on. Dude, oh wait, I gotta get a picture too with this new bait. Hold on. Yeah, let me grow. He hit it, jigging it off the bottom. You got the bogus? Dude. Holy shit, bro. Fish in the new Jig Pro, the three inch. Oh, make sure you get it in his mouth. Dude, I got this on, <laughs> I got this on the GoPro too. Dude, that is my PB weak fish for sure. Hold on, make sure I got him good. Is it gripped on there good? I got the orange thing. Holy crap dude that's a weak fish bro let's go here hold on let me get you to take a yeah here make sure you get a good picture i'm gonna 
in the little tiny kayak. Dude, bro. Bro. Now that is a weak fish, baby. Hell yeah, yeah dude. dude. Yes. Glad we didn't yes. leave yet. Dude, I'm telling you. I was like, dude. should I keep going shower? I'm gonna go shower. How do they eat? Are they good eating? I don't know. I want to let that big boy go. It's so cool to see. And it gave me such a good fight, bro. Here, hold on, buddy. I'm gonna let you go. That is my PB weak fish all day long. See you, bud. Kicked off strong. Spoke it into existence, baby. Let's go. Good looks on the net job. What's that? Me either. <laughs> Me either. Last time was a flounder, this time a weekie. Dude! Did you see how hard he was fighting? In, yeah, basically like right here. I'm fishing the quarter ounce and I was just jigging it real slow like this off the bottom and I just felt it get inhaled. And I just set the hook and I was like, yo, what is this? This is something kind of big. Yeah, well you see where the water line is. That's what made me, I was just letting the wind push me this direction. Sick. Yeah, the last time I, I ate a weak fish, it wasn't that great. Remember when me and Willie caught all those ones at the inlet? But it was nowhere near that size, none of them. <laughs> There's plenty of bluefish around. But the weakies, I was like, you know, I might as well let them live. I know. I should have got a measurement. I don't know what I'm thinking. Yeah, I'm going to just call it a 24. It might have been bigger. I have a measuring tape right in my book bag, but oh well. The picture's really the best part for me. I snagged him on the way up. Now I think I got him snagged. I might not even need the bogus. Oh, nope, see? I got it. He popped off. Dude, I he went for it, but I snagged him on the way up. The Jig Pro. Yeah. Jig Pro is getting it done, baby. Thing is a work of art, too. Yep. I was like right next to me, honestly. But I was casting it that way. Like this, just bringing it in. It was at the end of my cast, the end of my retrieve. Right? That's why I always fish. Yep. So now I used the one a quarter ounce Jig Pro to catch that big weak fish. And now a three quarter ounce Jig Pro, a four inch to catch that blue fish. So let's go. Dude, I watched him swim up and eat it. Oh my gosh, dude. Watched him swim up and eat it. I did, I just turned the GoPro off too. I was like sitting here talking to you about paddling in to take a piss. Yeah, blue. Oh, dude. Just got me soaked. Yeah, pull me around. Good job, buddy. Barely's got it. I thought he was gonna dig it. There you go. Yes, sir. Another fish on the board. Yeah. Guess they like those chunky little boy. Yeah, they like those jig pros. Oh, did he? That's okay. Oh, here, let me open the bail. All right, here, hold on. Damn, he is a thrasher. Jeez, dude, chill out. Let's go. Hell yeah. Stuck yes, out. sir. Nothing's been hitting my white. He's off. No, not so the white. Look at this. See, this will work for a little bit. It's the same exact thing happened to me. Yeah. Look at a brick and a half. Bro. Yep. Same thing. Do you have any more of the plastics out here? Yeah. Well, not that color, actually. I had a feeling with this water color. Oh, it was in his eyeball. That's why. Jig Pro in black is getting it done, baby. Two blues and a weekie. Three blues, really. Forgot, I let that one 
pop off the hook on purpose. Let's go. Yes, sir. Of course, you know, a blue fish is gonna rip it apart. That's actually pretty cool. You can see that little cavity in there. That's awesome. Definitely digging these. What a day. Weird turn of events, but no surprise. I mean, I knew if I stuck it out long enough for the tide change, I'd end up catching something, but I was not expecting a 20-something inch weak fish. I think it was every bit of 26 myself, but... I'm gonna try fishing over here a little bit, too. So far, my favorite thing about these... Look how hard that was to pull off, but super easy to change and rig. Hold on, we're getting interrupted here. Forgot to finish my video. Oh well, where'd I throw that rip to him? I think I threw it behind the seat. But anyways, I was just saying how easy they are to rig and it comes out perfect every single time. Looks just like the one that got chewed in half by a bluefish. But it's so nice having that mark. So you know exactly where to put it in, exactly where to poke it out. And clearly the fish love it. Clearly the fish, oops, love it. Wow. Now I just got my hand and gloves soaked. I think we're about done here, folks. Or at least I'm content with today. That's for sure. I'm more than content. That was awesome. Let's go see if Jamie's had any more luck. Maybe we can get another one before we leave. I'm gonna try these shallows down here too. It just keeps getting better. I don't know if you can tell in this lighting, but they glow in the dark. I might have to go somewhere darker to show y'all, but that is awesome. I came in the house and it was dark in here and they start glowing. Or at least these two definitely do. That's pretty cool. There's a little better shot of the glow. That is awesome.